Components Introduction. Dai Shu. Rear Fire. Front Fire. Rear Fire Switch. Front Fire Switch. Glass beads tank. Glass beads switch. Glass beads dispenser. Connecting shaft. Pen tank. Handle. Rotate mixer. Paint filter, burner or pan tank, burner switch, paint outlet, igniter. Gas tank position. Indicative rod. Moving control joystick. Clutch. Engine Rear wheel holder Tooth box Operation steps Connect the gas valve to gas tank Turn on gas tank valve. Turn on igniter. Night igniter. Ignite rear file while turn on its switch. Notice preheat the rear file about 10 minutes on low flame. Ignite burner or pan tank. While turning on a switch, notice preheat the pan tank about 10 minutes on low flame. Ignite front fire while turning on a switch. Notice only turn on front fire switch when it is below 10 degrees. Pull pan into pan tank. Put glass beads into glass beads tank. Adjust moving control joystick to neutral position. Put clutch in this separation position. Start engine. Align indicative rod with water line. Lock the rear wheel holder. Lay down die shoe lightly. Open paint outlet. Let some plastic paint flow into die shoe. Open die shoe. Turn on glass bead switch. Put clutch in operation position. Push moving control joystick forward. Start marking line. Finishing working. Close die shoe. Lift up die shoe. Turn off glass beads switch. 
close pen outlet. Adjust the moving control joystick to neutral position. Put clutch in separation position. Turn off valve of gas tank. Turn off switch of rear fire, front fire, and burner after gas burns out. Turn off engine. Maintenance. Wearing part. Rear wheel holder. Wearing parts, plastic strip of glass beads dispenser. After being used for the first time, replace engine oil after six months, then change it once a year. First step: let engine oil flow out from outlet. Second step: add new engine oil from inlet. Add engine oil more than half of the ruler. Notice. In nine working state, adjust moving control joystick to neutral position. While the machine is running, moving control joystick must be set in neutral position, then pull clutch to operation position. While pulling some plastic paint into paint tank, Clutch must be placed at the separation position. Notice When finish the construction, clean up the remaining paint in the tank. If the remaining paint is not cleaned up, you have to spend much longer time on preheating which will shorten pan tank's service life. Rear blade and side blades of die shoe must be fully preheated before marking lines about 10 minutes. Too low temperature of rear and side blades will lead to coarse line surface and sawtooth shaped edge of lines. Front fire should be ignited only when the temperature is below 10 degrees. Rear fire should be kept at low flame in case that rear blade is damaged because of overheating. When pan temperature is too high, decrease fire switch. When pan temperature is too low, increase fire switch. Lock the rear wheel when transporting. Avoid the bump of glass bits quantity controller during transportation. Avoid the bump of rear blades and side blades of die shoe during transportation. FAQ Question 1. How to change a pan tank? Answer. Loosen the paint outlet screws and tighten screws at the bottom of the paint tank, then replace a new tank. Loosen screw of outlet. Loosen screw of paint tank. Remove paint tank. Burner of pan tank. Replace new pan tank. Tighten up screw of pan tank. 
tighten up screw of outlet. Question 2. Why do the glass beads sometimes flow on or sink in the line? Why the glass beads floating on the lines, which means the temperature of pan tank or preheater is too low, or the distance between glass beads dispenser and die shoe is too far? Why the glass beads sinking in the lines, which means the temperature of pan tank or preheater is too high, or the distance between glass beads dispenser and the dye shoe is too close. Question 3. How to deal with the problem in question 2? Answer. For the floating on the line, first, raise the temperature of some plastic paint in pan tank and preheater. At the same time, major adjustment. Second, adjust the position of glass beads dispenser to close to the die shoe and raise the temperature of paint in paint tank at the same time, minor adjustment. For sinking in the line, first reduce the temperature of the plastic paint in paint tank and preheater at the same time, major adjustment. Second, adjust the position of glass beads dispenser to away from the die shoe and reduce the temperature of paint in pan tank at the same time, minor adjustment. Raise or reduce the temperature of paint in the pan tank. Adjust the position of dispenser. Place the dispenser close to the die shoe. If the glass beads float on lines, why away from the die shoe if they sink below lines? Question 4. How to know whether fire nozzle is blocked? What can we do to unblock the nozzle? Answer. When the nozzle is blocked, it will speed weak fire. All the fire will turn red and mark lines with sawtooth edges. In that case, use a needle to unlock it. Clear up impurities in the fine nose by needle. Question 5. What should we do to replace the broken fine nozzle? Answer. Take down the fine cover, then replace a new fine nozzle. Then paste the liquid room material belt on spiral of nozzle screw. Take down rear fire cover and nozzle. Paste liquid room material belt on spiral of screw. Question 6. How to adjust the thickness of marking lines? Answer. The only factor that affects line thickness is the distance between the rear blade and the ground. Two ways to adjust this factor. First, loosen the hang screw of die shoe, then adjust the distance between die shoe and the ground. Minor adjustment. Adjust the range from 0 to 0 0.5 mm. Second, loosen the screws of rear blade, then adjust the distance between rear blade and the ground. Major adjustment. Adjustment range above 0 0.5 mm. Considering the high temperature, this way is not suitable for working conditions. Loosen high screw of die shoe, then adjust the distance between die shoe and the ground. The closer the distance is, the thinner the lines are. The farther the distance is, the thicker the lines are. Adjust the position of rear blade like this to make the lines thinner. Adjust the position of rear blade like this to make the lines thicker. 
The thickness range of marking lines is from 1 to 4 mm for both standard and customized die shoe. Question 7. What should we do while changing different colors of paint with only one paint tank? Answer. Take down the paint tank cover and the mixer. Wear gloves to shove out paint when the paint is still a little hot. Loosen screws of paint tank cover, then take down the cover mixer and filter. Shove out the remaining paint in the tank. Question 8. Why the tires are solid? Answer. To prevent tire explosion when temperature is high. First question. Does the moving speed affect the thickness of line? Answer. Yes, it does. Generally, RS2 is supposed to move at a normal speed, but the line will be thicker when the speed is too low and the line will be thinner when the speed is too high. Keep the moving control joystick at the position when the machine is running. Thank you for watching.